public service announcement where government help is really needed. Three quarters of the world's poor live in rural areas. The depressed world prices created by farm p policies over the past few decades have been had a devastating effect. There has been, long, been a long-term fall in investment in farming and the things that sustain it, such as irrigation. The share of public spending goes to agriculture in developing countries has fallen by half since 1980. Poor countries that used to export food now import it. Reducing subsidies in the West would help reverse this. The World Bank reckons that if you free up agriculture trade, the prices of of things poor countries specialize in, like cotton, would rise, and developing countries would capture the gains by increasing exports. And because farming accounts for two-thirds of jobs in the poorest countries, it is the most important contributor to the early stages of economic growth. According to the World Bank, the really poor get three times as much extra income from an increase in the farm productivity as from the same gain in industry or services. In the long term, thriving farms and open markets provide a secure food supply. However, there is an obvious catch and one that justifies government help. High prices have a mixed impact on poverty. They hurt anyone who loses um, more from deer food than he gains from a higher income. And that means over a billion urban consumers and, and some landless laborers, many of whom are politically influential in, their, in poor countries. Given the speed of this year's food pri ri price rises, governments in emerging uh, markets have no alternative but to try to soften the blow. Where where they can, these governments should should subsidize the, the incomes of poor of the poor rather than um, food itself because that minimizes price distortions where food subsidies are unavoidable, they should be temporary and targeted on the poor. So far, most government interventions in the poor ha world have failed. These test politicians who seem to think cheap food part of the natural order of things should, ha should have slapped on price controls and exports.